Hi, Ni Hao, I'm Chef Tom. We have these two beautiful meat. This one is elk and this one is venison. Very nice lean meat. First of all, you need to trim off all the silver skin because that is the one will have a lot of taste on the wild game's meat. So here I have some mushroom, green onion already chopped. And cooking this meat, we want to make sure not overcook. We want the meat to be taste tender and juicy. So here, I'm just going to cut it. See the meat is very lean. It's so easy to cut. About a quarter inch. And I'm going to give them a really quick, simple marinade. And this meat is not tough at all. It's so tender, very tender. Just make sure you're not overcook. If you grill, I suggest the inner temperature is about like 275, something like that, and let them rest for a long time. And this venison, we cut the meat against the grain. Beautiful. And sometime my butcher can get me some mousse. Those are wonderful meat to cook. I like to marinate it and just sim simply grill. But this time we're going to saute and stir fry. I got this beautiful onion. Onion will give them a very nice aromatic. When you saute the onion, it's supposed to be nicely flavored and the sweet aromatic. Okay, the onion's done. We're gonna separate the meat and the onion, just like this. We are going to marinate the meat. Saoxing wine. It's a very nice ingredient wine to marinate for Asian cooking or marinated. Drizzle in. Light sodium soy sauce or regular soy sauce, doesn't matter. Soy sauce about flavor. Before I marinate it or cut the meat, make sure the meat have to be patted really dry. Oyster sauce, umami. Eyeball it. Hey, look, it's time to get another bottle. Love grocery shopping. What should you sauce? Whatever they call, right? It's got good flavor. Really good flavor for me. Yeah, I can smell the aromatic already. Roaster dark sesame oil. You can put a lot more. It's okay for marinade because we might need to borrow this oil to cook. Ground pepper. A lot. And do mucho, muka. Yeah? Yeah, okay. And then we're just going to simply mix it up. Make sure all the meat cover up with this beautiful umami flavor. Oh, yes. Very nice. Very nice. Ah, so lean, man. It's a great protein. We don't get this meat all the time, but once in a while, my butcher have a special. We've been using our same butcher for 46 years from the restaurant. At Pack. 
He's the biggest wild meat games meat distributor in Michigan. Okay, we're gonna let them sit and rest. Go uh, relax for like maybe 20 25 minutes. We have the onion chopped ready. If you want to add some bell pepper. Oh, I got some basil. Yes. Gonna be great. Of course. Homemade Chef Tom mint, ginger, and garlic. Cast iron, preheat the frying pan. This dish, we're gonna use some butter. Some extra virgin olive oil or just regular cooking oil. We're trying to be fancy, you know. <laughs> Some, of course, ginger and garlic mint. <sighs> smells so good. The whole house is gonna be smell amazing. Stir until aromatic. Make sure not burn the butter or the ginger and garlic, okay? So here, you're gonna see. Oh, beauty, done. We're gonna add all the sauce in, in the cast onion. Separate, spread it out nicely. Like this. And here, we're gonna add some onion. Oh boy, nicely done. Stir it. If the fire is too hot, guess what? Turn it down, right? Stir it. Ah, this is a very nice flavor. Flavor. Ground pepper, always handy. Boom, boom. Right there. And give them refreshing some ground pepper. Kosher salt, just a little dash, okay? Because we got soy sauce already. Not too salty, not too salty. Just like that. Stir, 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 stir. Soften the onion. It's already had wonderful flavor. Ginger, garlic, butter, extra virgin olive oil. You see how nice this is? Yes, yes, yes. Now, we're gonna put this into this pot. The meat already have a lot of juice, okay? Oh yes, look at that. And this juice is really good. We're just gonna add this one in. Elk and venison. That's how you do it at home. Saute. They're still nicely pink, right? Remember I said not overcooked? Alright, so this one we're gonna add some paprika. Cookies about ingredients, flavor. Paprika got really nice flavor. And here, we're gonna add some onion and mushroom. Oh boy. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, look at this. Oh, so delicious. Still pink outside. Oh.
Make sure you spread out the meat so they can cook evenly. Beauty. Oh yeah. Okay. Now this one is done. Give a little taste. Oh my goodness. So good. So good. I cannot believe it. Hmm. Let's take a little piece. Look at look at how beautiful. Nice and tender. Look at this piece. Look at this piece. Huh? Mmm, mmm, mmm. Turn it off. Mmm. So good. It doesn't have the game meat taste because you marinate it. The meat is so tender. Okay, this one's done too, like this. There's enough juice. I don't want the juice inside because the juice gets yeah, some of the the blood is from the game, you know? We don't want that. We want the fresh. Take this one off. Here we're gonna saute it. Oh look at that. Look at this. Alright. Now if you want to add soy sauce or any other sauce or teriyaki, your homemade homemade recipe sauce, go right ahead, no problem. But I like a nice, simple, delicious flavor. Paprika. This one I can add some basil. You know why? Because going to your fridge, you are going to have something that you see need to be cooked right away, or it's gonna go to waste. Basil, cilantro, anything you have. Look, hey. Will you marry me? <laughs> ah, crazy. All right, here we go. Basil, oh, look at that. Flavor, basil flavor. Get that a little more black pepper. Mmm. My boys, my three boys are into working out. I'm gonna give this to them. Beautiful, turn off. I don't want to overcook. As I say, I just want to show you. Look at this piece. Look at this piece. Look at that. Huh? Elk and venison. Huh. Money can no buy this kind of meat, I tell you. So good. So good for you. I take a little piece, little piece, tiny one, little one like this. Look at how beautiful. Oh, I got to aim it to the camera. Look at how, oh, look at how beautiful that. Wait, let me. Sorry, it's a one-man show here. You see that? How beautiful? Nicely done. This piece for me. Oh, wow. This is better flavor because they got... Mm, basil. My friend, that's how you cook. I hope you like the video. I'm Chef Tom. i see you next time. Bye. I'm going to eat now.